Ralph Irvin and Jackie Robinson in the stadium where Saturday night the UCLA Bruins were 6-3 winners over LSU. The Bruins are one win away from the Super Regionals. Here's UCLA head coach John Savage. It was a big win. I mean, whenever you, you win the second game of a regional, um, that's a big step in the right direction. So uh, we're in a good place, but the players know that, you know, this far from over and we still have very three very good teams left in this tournament. So uh, we still have some work to do, but it was a, it was a, it was a good night for the Bruins. And we scored six, six uh, runs in, in six innings, so we never had a big inning. And uh, we kind of pecked away and we wore uh, Ronaldo down a little bit, who's very, very good. I mean, he's a first round guy, so uh, he struck out 10 guys. and. But it was a credit to our offense because we just kind of kept on pecking away and, and got enough runs. I think that fifth and sixth runs were big late in the game and kind of separated the, you know, the score a little bit and it proved out that uh, we needed that. So uh, you're right, we, we kind of pecked away and at the end of the game, we, you know, we won the ball game. We won 43 games for a reason. I mean, with consistency and, and uh, the same rotation we've had all season long, which I don't think many teams can say they've done that. And, and so we started Garrett last night, and he was fabulous, and he threw his five innings, and Trevor did what he needed to do tonight against LSU, and we're going to give the ball to Rob tomorrow. The star of the night for UCLA was pitcher Trevor Bauer, who shut down the LSU bats for most of the night. He was good. Uh, he was special. I mean, he was... Uh, he was as good as he's been all season, and it's unfortunate that you know we didn't finish the game with him in the ninth. But that you know it's, that's not important. I mean, really, it's a it's a, a guy coming in the ball game, Dan Klein, who, who's as good as there is in the country, closing out games. And so there's a ton of confidence. But Trevor was special. He made pitches all night. He pitched out of problems. I think he had 11 strikeouts in, in eight innings, and uh, he was as good as he's been all season. So it was great to see him uh, pitch at such a high level. To me, is another game. Obviously, great opponent, great atmosphere and uh, you know a lot on the line but you can't think like that and I wasn't going to do anything different than I have been all year just I think the atmosphere kind of helped me with my focus and you know to be more focused throughout the entire game but other than that as far as in between inning stuff and you know on the mound stuff nothing was different. He really emphasized tonight going pitch to pitch and uh, you know that's what I did I think that was more of my focus um, than it has been all year I think if there's one thing that was different it was more so just get to the next pitch and focus on the next pitch and that's what I did. You go around, Bo made a great catch in, in center. Nico made a couple nice plays at, up the middle. You know, the rebate first, Ramy on the double play at second, picking up a ball that you know kind of kicked off Nico on a tough play. It's great all around. And Stevie, you can't say enough about Stevie behind the plate. He was, he was outstanding once again. Once again, UCLA a 6-3 winner over LSU. The Bruins back in action on Sunday at 6 o'clock. They will take on the winner of UC Irvine and LSU. Of course, the best news and notes on UCLA baseball, as well as game broadcast, you get it all right here, UCLABruins.com.